Welcome back to our Sims 4 cast challenge for October. Today is the 26th, so our prompt word is hide. And yes, we're doing a cat, because I can't do a dog without doing a cat. That's just not fair. And hide is the perfect word, I think, for cats. We're going to make a little bit of a skitterbug kitten. Cats, just like in The Sims 2, I feel like didn't get the variety that dogs did. I mean, I think that they did a good job, but I just... You almost can feel the lack of love a little bit. Although they did make the werewolf cat. You know, like you do. So since we're making a Heidi cat, I think maybe a Savannah would be a good choice. I mean, they're not at all subtle or sneaky, but... Mm. See, that doesn't look like an oriental long hair at all. Just saying being salty. Let's do a Tonkinese. I do love the Tonks. Yes, they are different than Siamese. As evidenced here. Quiet. Alright, so I want to make a little bit of a skinny little Heidi cat. Just like skinny, skinny, skinny kitty. Oh well. That's not what I wanted to do. But like, big head. <laughs> like, Big apple head. Oh, gosh. Pull the mouth out more. Let's give it, like, a bull tarot. Oh, jeez. Rude. This is rude. Can we give him... Oh! Scottish bold ears! Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, those are so cute. Which ones do I like better? I think I like the flat ones. Also, my cat is like losing its mind in the background. It's like, um, excuse you. How dare you? Are we just gonna go all in and just make the buggiest eyed cat that we can? I think we are. Because why not, you know? We're a bit of a special kitty. In the best of ways. I don't know why they have like this like really extreme bump there. I think that's a little weird. So we're this little skinny kitty. Teeny feet. Maybe not that skinny. Skinny little rat tail, though, for sure. Oh god, it's got a bit of an underbite. Oh, precious. Okay. I'm gonna leave the eyes. I'm happy with the eyes. Color wise, I want kind of a dark colored kitty. Looks like they're gonna blend in with anything. Stash kitty. I do like torties. <laughs> That's cool. Also cool. They did do a good job of the cat coats. I'll give them that. not as many though. Again, I just feel like the cats did not get the love that dogs did. I kind of like this and then I can make this black as well. It's like a really severe tortoiseshell. I oh, did this part orange and this part black. No. Just 
Oh, whoops. Is this one that I changed? No. Which one did I change? That one. I mean, I kind of like... I kind of like it as is. And maybe we can just paint in a few of these whites, like some of the white. Oh. Oops. almost like a blue merle. The goal here is to just kind of make a cat that's a lot darker than what we had. I know I didn't fill any of the black spots in, or any of the white spots in, but that's what's coming next. I think this is a pretty cute kitten. Cute as a button. And since Hyde likes to hide, let's get them a dark little sweatshirt so they can feel safe and secure. And there you have it. This is little Hyde Scaredy Cat. 
also going to be a mixed breed because adopt don't shop. We are not going to be friendly though. We are going to be skittish, but playful and curious. Actually, affectionate. So while Hyde is really scared of strangers, Hyde loves his people. He loves his people and he wants to be around his people and he just wishes that his people wouldn't be around other people. Is that too much to ask? Hyde doesn't think so. so. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I hope that you appreciated it. I know I'm not as good in the cat. I can see the lines of just didn't do as well on the cat as I would have liked to, but I'm still happy with how they turned out. They're very zebra budded, but that's okay. So yeah, thank you guys so much for joining me. If you know who should own Hide the Cat, definitely let me know in the comments below out of the sims that I've made this month. And I will see you in the next one.